Ah! No! Bad! There we go! This is it! This is it! The finale! The end of the millennium! Of our playthrough! And I think I spelled millennium wrong! That's okay! Because... This is it! We're gonna save the fucking star system! We're gonna save everyone! Well, Rune is, uh, Chaz is not gonna do anything because he fucking sucks. How are you all doing today? I hope you are doing fantastic. I'm... Uh, I didn't sleep as much as I would have liked to, but you know what? That is okay. We are still hype. We are still here to play some motherfucking fantasy star in what may be the finale. So, uh, let's go ahead and check in. Booty Panda, how you doing? Thanks for coming by. Have a relaxing stay. Thank you, come again. Hopefully the planet is not destroyed by a terrible ice age. Yeah, 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 we're working on it, we're working on it. Uh, it's been a little bit since uh, we were here, so uh, let's go over our party here. Boop. This is Rune. He is the leader of the pack. He is too cool for school, and he knows it, and we love him for it. He's the coolest member of our group. There is Kira. I have literally nothing to say about her because we just met her. Uh, apparently she, uh, is in the room. Hey, I appreciate that. Caleb's a cool dude. Uh, this is Ren who is a cyborg who worked at Space Station Kevin, running everything uh, in the Algo star system. Then it all broke because, uh, oops. This is Rika, who is uh, the, a Newman, which is a uh, fantasy star way of saying elf. You see, she joined the party and was, uh, because she was upset that Ren stopped texting her and he, she thought that he ghosted her. And it turns out, no, he was just in a bad signal area. Which made things really weird between her and Chaz, who is a fucking moron, and everyone hates him, and nobody likes him, and he's not good at anything. He's also very dumb. That is why Rune is the leader of our party. Uh, we had another party member, uh, Piccolo, uh, who uh, is upstairs, you know, dying of zombie virus. And now we have to uh, save Planet Namek uh, from the Blueskins who are spreading zombie virus everywhere. This is it. So we got the magical fire. We got the magical fire! Banish you to the shadow realm. Hooray! It's been a long mission, hasn't it? We we just met you, but all right. Now let's get to Guru Tower. Save Piccolo. That didn't take long. Cast shield! Now everyone beat up the zombies! Bad smell? Ha! And just like that, a winner is me! Wow, that was a lot of XP. Oh no, potato head monsters. Ah! Monster designs for sprites like this always mystifies me in the fact that it's... 
they create frightening looking creatures by just combining whatever is laying around and you're never sure exactly how they put these together how these are supposed to function and then they do weird shit oh it's all gross and sphinctery guru tower more like guru belly gross Suck. Oh, this dude dodges? Yeah, no, 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 none of that. Get out of here. Get out of here with that. Rika leveled up. Don't, 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 don't. Before we go any further, gonna heal everybody. He's Chaz's HP. suck. Whatever. Dun, 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 dun. There's nothing interesting here. Fucking whip their asses! I miss having Piccolo. He was a great he, he, uh, cleric. For some reason, Piccolo was a cleric. I don't know why. There's literally a giant eyeball. That's not interesting to you? Pretty powerful. I don't know if they're overpowered or overleveled. Are you off Namek? No, we are uh, inside the Sarlacc Tower for some reason. she taking all of those attacks that's incredibly unnecessary come on Kira you'll make me fight for every fucking floor I get aren't you All right. 
That's the sphincter elevator that I uh, took in to get in here. Where the fuck do I go? See, that is the true trap of uh, Guru Tower, is the entire place is a giant sphincter. It is always changing. Hold on, let me winks! The only thing here that uh, potentially does anything is this giant fuck off eyeball. Ah! The eyeball did something! Reconfigured the whole dungeon. Mm. Yeah. These guys aren't tough, they're just fucking obnoxious. Every six feet with these guys, god damn. Nobody I know uses shields. Although, if I could uh, shield on Kira, maybe she'll stop fucking eating shit. He's like a motherfucker, at least. Can we please stop fighting every Tom, Dick, and Harry in the house? Wasn't there a sphincter door around here? Enter! Ah, gross. Hmm. 
Nice. Let's hear that, Micah. I don't think I'm getting away from these guys. They look like they mean business. Ball or a sphincter door. So why is this place all fucking like gooey? What well, does the centaur tech man? That is literally just take a man blade. Ha! Enter the sphincter door. It's so gross, you'll be going places. That was a big one. And they burning through my TP. Crazy, man. That means that's not the right sphincter door. We gotta go to the other sphincter door we passed. That is uh, Doctor Doom. So if he was a Jawa. Enter. Ah, cool. Ah, gross. The floor is all moving and shit. Getting real tired of fighting these fucking scrubs. Like TBH.
Like, I understand that in an RPG you have to have the encounters because if you don't get the XP, you'll be underleveled by the time you get to uh, the bosses. But... I feel like, you know... Pokemon was really re seems to be really revolutionary in that it had an item that uh, negated the encounter rate. Because sometimes you're powerful enough that just getting through an area with a random encounter rate being really high, uh, even for story reasons, is just obnoxious. Earthbound did, if you were a certain level, the encounter happened, then you didn't, uh, then just didn't take you into battle, you just said you won. Right! Shit like that happens, like, unnecessarily. We're all set. What the hell? That's a big dude. Shit. That's the door we came through, isn't it? Man. If I have to go get a fucking map of Sphincter Tower here, I'm gonna be very upset. Fucking go! Oh shit, it's Cobra Commander again! You thought you'd seen the last of me! Cobra! What are the odds of running into Cobra Commander? Cobra Commander a punk. Save. That's not the way.
No, not there. This is ridiculous! I just want to go and fight the big guy! Let me go! At least my success rate for running away is pretty solid. Sink the door, activate! Well, I'm running into new enemies, so I'm going the right way. Walked off my big boy attack. Learn Nasser. Oof. I have to kick that one. It's a big risk, you know, running from all these battles like I am. Um, cause again, I might be, uh, I might be over, I might be leveled just right, but I could also be uh, accidentally under leveling myself by not fighting them. It's a bold strategy, Cod, and let's see if it pays off. Cause I just, I just want to get out of this fucking tower because I. Uh, I don't like the f uh, the fleshy wall textures. Cool, we finally found a fight we can't run from. The Jester kits are supposed to be really nice.
Maybe these are just buffing themselves. This is outrageous! Holy shit, how did I do that? Ah, uh, Chaz eating shit is a is a necessity. It is also an eventuality. Only guys I can't run from right now are the um, uh, are the knights. If there's like two or three of them, I went the wrong way, I guess. Uh, uh, please don't make me go look up a map of Stinker City here. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I do not wish to do it. do anything over here? Yup. This figure goes out here now. I'm tired of fighting you, Cobra Commander. We settled our difference at the Flying Castle when we killed Shao Kahn, who was also Serpentor. What a strange day that was. Saved. Are we fucking there yet? Oh my god! Shut up, Chaz. data. It is not similar to any object that was on Kevin. So there were two dark forces. It's just as Piccolo said. This is what's been creating havoc on Desolate Namek. I thought he said it was the Blueskins. His racism aside, we should do something about this. No, not just Namek. He's been messing with the entire Algo star system. Dark Force senses our presence. He is attacking. Exactly what we were hoping for! I wasn't. Let's go, everyone! What the fuck? Ho! 
Holy shit! Thankfully, I saved like two doors back. Hi, Lado. Okay. So what does it do? Okay, so uh, we're going to go down here, we're going to create a new macro, it's going to be uh, Rika, Devin, Ren, Barrier, uh, Rune, And Kira uh, will do nothing and try not to get hurt. Okay. Let's fucking go! We went through all this before! Come on! Man! It's crazy! 
Hold on. Okay, let's try it out. Fucking no! All of a sudden it decided, no, you can't escape. Getting expensive. Guys, again, if this doesn't work, then we'll need to uh, regroup and come up with a new plan. A plan. A P-A-L-N plan. Because clearly what I'm doing isn't fuck wouldn't be fucking working. Dabbin. Barrier.
Okay, we're still in this. We're still in this. Uh. And this. Has. I didn't do anything. Okay. Um. Do it! I wish I had an item that revived people. Well, that was fucking pointless. This is getting intense! Do I have any other do's? Got a do to do.
I'm literally just trying to keep everyone alive! Chaz eats shit! Oh, we won! Chaz gets no experience points from the boss. Truly, there is a god. We did it. Everyone, except Chaz. Yeah! Wait! I was here, too. The storm is over. Wow! Look at the sky! It's beautiful! The black energy wave has also stopped. I bet the patients of Mies are already recovering. It's finally over. Good! Thank you, everyone. It's because of your cooperation that this was possible. It was pretty presumptuous of me to think that I could do it alone. No. No problem. I'm glad for you, Kira. Now I shall return to Mies. There's still a lot of work ahead of me. So long, Chaz. Ah, <laughs> you got brother's own. What? That's not fair! <laughs> That's what's so endearing about you. Bye! Goodbye, Rune! Call me! You were way cooler than I expected, but you certainly did not bring shame. I hope we meet again soon. Oh, hell yes we will. So long! See you later! She's gone. She called me her baby brother. Do I suck that hard? Yes. You've improved some, but you're still a thousand years too early to stand on my level. Dang it. Well, I can't compare with you. After all, you're the party leader. Ah, you finally see things my way. Good. That'll save some time. So, you want to get your ass whipped again? You guys never quit, do you? <laughs> what was that? What was that? It's the Gumby Temple. What is going on? We defeated the Dark Force. We should go check it out. Okay, so I guess we're playing Zionic Front next month. Or next month, next week. <sighs> hey! Tofu, how's it going? Hello, Raiders! You are here for the finale of uh, Fantasy Star 4. Okay. And there's nothing interesting here. Oh, you guys missed it. Chaz ate so much shit at the last boss. Like, all of the shit. You wouldn't believe it. Oh, great. I'm in a bad way. Hey, Cuban Anubis, don't stub your pinky toe now. Otherwise, then you'll have to spend a year 
watching DS9 and drink it off with uh, Jack Daniels to recover. I don't make the rules. Oh, oh, the price went down. Ah, oh, it feels so nice to be recovered. Now let's go next door and pick, get Piccolo back. It's good that the illness is gone, but... Everybody's getting better without waiting for the medicine to be made. I'm so glad. Whatever. It's cause for celebration. Celebration, bitches! Piccolo. This person. They say his name is Piccolo. It's great that he's getting better, but he keeps telling these stupid jokes. And talking about exterminating the blueskins. How do you put up with him? I'm not his dad. I feel better. I need a lot more time in bed. I see you have a change, Piccolo. Um. Well, all right then. I thought we were gonna get our fucking uh, our healer back, but you know, whatevs. All right, let's see. Bada 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 bam. You go. Go to Gumby Temple. Holy shit! It is a hole in the ground. Powerful waves of pure hate assaulted this temple. The bishop had his hands full just to protect this one room. With such a sudden thing, there was no way to deal with it. And we are all safe is quite the miracle. We are thanks to the bishop. So you are the people who saved the Eclipse Torch. Glad you're here. The bishop awaits you. This when we thought the dark clouds lifted and the malice was gone. It's good you came. I am the Bishop of Gumby Temple, which stood here for 2,000 years. Bishop, what on earth is going on? The temple has vanished without a trace. We've defeated Dark Force. Aren't we fucking done? The Profound Darkness still exists. What is the Profound Darkness? It is the root of all evil that has wrought death and destruction in Ongo since long ago. Dark Force is but a tool of their existence. Oh. Oh, yeah, I know what that is. Well, that doesn't sound good. Dark Force. He came to Namek to search for the whereabouts of Rick Ross. Rick Ross? Rick Ross? Rick Ross. Rick Ross! It has become something that is beyond your control. That's why the profound darkness stirs. If it cannot lay its hands on it, it's not going to let you get a hold of it. Bishop, we don't understand. What is Rick Ross? Is there something so important that we have to scramble and find it? We do that a lot. It's the place where all the secret answers lie. Huh? What do you mean? It's not clear to me either what Rick Ross is or where it is. Rick Ross returns, the arrow prism will show the way. I know nothing but that saying. Arrow prism? Uh, the light of the arrow prism, which illuminates everything. Rune, you knew about it the whole time? Of course I did, I know everything. We gotta get off this planet, like right now. What? The first ch uh, Old loot stored the arrow prism in the soldier's temple. The temple on the island in the lake near Krupp. We need a vehicle that can travel across that lake. I will contact Demi immediately. Bishop, thank you. We'll be sure to return the Eclipse Torch. So you will go to Rick Ross? Sure. After all, that's the thing that we do. I hope everyone's having a good day. Thank you for coming and uh, watching potentially the ending of uh, a classic RPG. Butchered by my horrible voice acting and characterization. I see, and I've done my part. 
All I could do was point you towards Rick Ross. It is up to you to shape history. All hope is on you, youthful ones. Especially that girl with the uh, plump thighs and the gorgeous booty. <laughs> Chaz. My, his name is Chaz Ashley. Chaz has a last name? Chaz has a last name and it's Ashley. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to take a moment of your time. Uh, Chaz is a sad sack of piece of shit. He's supposed to be the hero we're rooting for. And we've decided unanimously to replace him with Rune, who is better in every single way. Also, Chaz's last name is Ashley. Chaz Ashley. I'm sorry, this is, um... That's a terrible last name for a hero. Should be like Chaz Alright or Chaz Alex or Chaz Axel. Unbelievable. Are we gonna find out everyone else has last names too now? I see. I entrust you with this mission, Chaz Ashley, to eat all of the shit. I can do that. We've been waiting for you, Master Ren. Long time no see. I'm glad you're all looking so well. Demi, what is the condition of Motavia? All systems on hold. There's no abnormalities. Everything you requested is already ready to rock and roll! As always, your preparations are impeccable, Demi. Oh, thank you very much, Master Ren! I'm so happy! What is that? This is the hydrofoil! We brought it from the machine center! It's been completely overhauled! And it kind of looks like the car from Cyber Formula! It's as good as new! By using this, we can move across the water. Okay, Chaz. Let's get a move on at Hedford Soldier's Temple. Right. Demi, are you ready to rock? I'm sorry, but at this point, I don't think I can be of use to you. The restart of all the sisters in Motavia will take some time. Oh. Uh, that's a pity. Well, good luck to you two. Thanks, Rika! You passive-aggressive bitch! Okay, let's head to the soldier's temple. Uh, in Japanese, his name is Rudy Ashley. That's not that, that's not much better. Okay, Ryuka. Prop. Like, holy shit, that was fast. Did the, did the worms beef up while I was going? That is absurd speed! 
Huh? Are you guys here to inspect the runes? Uh, sure, but who the... who are you? Ah, forgive me for not introducing myself earlier! My name is Seth. I'm a traveling archaeologist. We're awfully late in the game to be getting new friends. Oh, well, I'll just fuck off then. I came here in search of uh, the ruins of an ancient temple. But there are monsters in that cave that leads to it. It fucking sucks, dude. The temple? Just where were you going? Ah, I knew it. Ah, how fortunate. If that's where you're headed, allow me to come with you. I have confidence in my skills. And I don't intend to be a nuisance. Well, what are your skills? Well, I'm an archaeologist. I'm also a professional masseuse. Wait, he's a masseuse? I have this knot in my shoulder. Could you get that out? Oh, totally. I can get that out. If there are monsters, the more of us there are, the more advantageous it'll be in a fight against them. I guess it's okay, then. Not that I have a say in it. He's right. He doesn't have a say in it at all. I say it's fine. I like the cut of your jib, and you have a very fine mustache. I respect it. Thank you very much, sir, for your strange compliment, and I appreciate your kindness. Rune, he's quite a polite person. Huh? Oh, yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> I'm in there! Island Cave. Giant sand slugs. Yes. What the? Well, that was weird. Apparently, I'm overpowered for this particular section, which is fine with me. Each got a bunch of uh, experience. Nice. Ow. Chaz is poisoned. Ah, uh, he'll walk it off. Hold on. Chaz is always at the back of the line because he sucks. Chaz, these guys are weak as shit, and you can only do one damage? You fucking sack of shit? Man, the dude with the knife is doing more damage than you. You're literally hitting these guys with Thundar's fucking Sun Zord. Mr. Minger, how you doing? 
We are trying to get through here without Chaz eating all of the shit because he sucks. It is not going well for Chaz. Everyone else is doing fine. But we're trying to find Rick Ross. I don't know why, but the name Rick Ross just sounds familiar. Like, it should be somebody I should know. Micah, who is Rick Ross? Yeah. As one does. It, it, is Rick Ross any good as a rapper? Well, that's the important thing, I suppose. Well, we're gonna go find this rapper, and uh, apparently they have all the secrets to everything that's going on and how to do something about it. Okay, I don't have her anymore. So, uh, attack. What's... What does he have? He's got nothing! He sucks! here to wreck all of your shit. Ah, hey, no, no spitting. No spitting. That's gross. Chaz didn't get to do shit. Get a lot of experience for uh, how uh, easy these battles are. Got corrosion? Ha! Ah, take that! Mm. So, how's the end game been? Uh, well, Chaz has eaten all sorts of shit. Which everyone agrees is the most important thing. He can't even touch these guys. He basically has Thundar's fucking Sun Sword. Uh, which, you know, is a magical lightsaber made of fire. And he still can't put a hurting on these lizards.
everyone agrees that Chaz sucks, but uh, also that Chaz is basically the, the human shield of uh, the entire party. Chaz, you need to be a team player, and uh, you need to lay on that grenade, but I don't want to! I'm afraid we already voted, and you gotta do it. Oh, this sucks! Stupid democracy. Everything here is pretty beefy in terms of experience, though. Say, that's not supposed to happen. Because they split up the experience that uh, shrunk to shit. So apparently we are looking for rapper Rick Ross because they know they have the secret to the universe. They know how to save the day. I don't know why is rapper Rick Ross, but that's what uh, the uh, the the eldest Namek said. Also, Piccolo isn't dying anymore, but, um, he's not in a hurry to get out of bed because he's ogling nurses. It's His way is a strange way, but it is his. Take that! Oh my, you guys are super strong! You must have felled so many monsters by now! Uh, well not really. It's kind of embarrassing. I've killed lots of monsters. Chaz has not. Dang it. Ah! Kill the slug! Kill the giants! Wah! I've got all this money that I can't spend because it's Really nothing for me to spend money on. Giant evil bugs, we blue gender now. Well, none of them have a, an, ang an angry woman's crotch for a mouth. Which is a thing that all of the monsters in blue gender had in common. Vagina mouths. You know, if they dehumidified this cave, I don't think they'd have these slug problems anymore.
No, for that to happen, we need heavily armed and armor. Well, fantasy stars that kind of universe where uh, that kind of thing can happen. thing that uh, Chaz is good for right now is being heal bitch. Chaz, I stubbed my toe. Fix it. But I don't have that much magic left. I don't care. Fix it. Aww. Somewhere, uh, somewhere in this cave is a mystical stone that will take us to Rick Ross. Come on! It's getting rid goddamn ridiculous. There was a giant salt shaker. That was splendid! I would love to have that kind of strength. That is the result of many hours of training. You can become strong too if you put effort into it. So, Chaz, when are you going to put effort in becoming strong? You know, my shoulders are getting tired from carrying you everywhere. Training? I never considered that! Did you ever do any training, Chaz? Shut up! <laughs> Even canonically in the story, uh, everyone's making Chaz eat shit. Chaz fucking just sucks. the amount of experience these things give how little damage they do to make people say some funny things again. Look, a door! We should go through it. Margaret got a dog? That's awesome! What's the dog? What is the dog's name? This is important. Ah, we finally made it to the temple! This is all thanks to you! There may, st there may be monsters still. Please let me come with you a little while longer. Okay, you seem cool. Hmm. I don't like the looks of this uh, Seth guy. He uh, he's pretty sus. Ah, arrow prism. Hey, we did it. All right. 
So what the fuck do we do now? And how does this take us to Rick Ross? I... I don't know. Well, you're a big help! Notice that. Good, your eyes fucking work. Hold the arrow prism up to the sky. Thundercats! Ho! Da 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 da. Ow! I am stretching. Oh! Oh! It popped my neck and it hurt. It hurt, and it feels better now. Wow. Wow, we did that hurt for like a second. If Martyr has a dog, she should name it like Muffet. What's going on? How beautiful. Rick Ross is at the end of the light. That's beyond the skies! I will calculate the direction immediately. Aye! <laughs> Seth, what's wrong? Aye! Ah! Seth! It's not Seth! It, it was Dark Force the whole time! What? Dark Force has been pretending to be a human the whole time? No wonder he was complimenting Chaz all the time and talking about how cool he was. Only someone evil! <laughs> Only someone that evil would sit there and compliment somebody who sucks so much ass on the regular. Can Dark Force also evolve? Whether it evolves or not, here it comes! We have no choice. Let's fucking go! Um. You know, I was just joking earlier when I said that, you know, Seth was kind of sus. Uh, who would have thought that, you know, the, the, the whole time? Okay. Uh. 
Okay, where's, uh... Uh, Gears. Ah, oh, they suck! They skipped my turn! Can I fucking recovery tank him? Okay, let's try this again. Rock. Get in there. Come on! It's ridiculous how big this guy is.
right. Basically, just try to recovery tank and... Ah, this guy sucks! Refresh that barrier. Ugh! I'm just trying to keep everyone alive at this point. I am going to say, because I'm doing pretty all right so far. Gotta keep Rune alive. If he fucking dies on me, I'm fucked. Five people. Ugh. Oh, come on! This is bullshit! Come on! I feel like we're almost there!
Let's move. Okay, we're, we're, we're doing it. We're, we're, we're gonna do it. Ren can win this fight, uh, that would be so fucking sick. Nano machine, son. Defeated the boss for everyone. I hope that's okay. Yeah, this is becoming a sticky situation. Uh, Chaz, let's get to Rick Ross. What? I bet the followers of Darkness are already aware of the way to Rick Ross through Dark Force. They're probably on their way there even as we speak. You mean they were spying on us? Rick Ross. The only thing certain is the direction in which he is located. No doubt there is something that there that they can't afford to let us have. So we better get that something. We'll have to hurry, otherwise they'll beat us to it. I have the direction of Rick Ross stored in my memory, but... The light is now extending far beyond the sky. Just to head, to, head towards it in the land now. Yeah, let's go to the spaceport! Woo, spaceships! Okay, do I have a uh, telepipe? Oh no! This is bad! Better off saving that, but I'm stuck. Time, baby. We're going to Rick Ross. Did 
Are we going the right way? We are currently on course. Is it an island like the space air castle? Or is it an artificial satellite like Zelen or Kevin? If we keep this course, we will leave the Algo star system. We have no choice but to keep going. What? This is crazy! Hey, the arrow prism again! Whew! That scared me. I wonder what happened. Hey, Dum Dum, look. It's a planet. A planet has... Hey, Dr. Headlock, how you doing? Thanks for coming by. It's a planet. A planet has suddenly appeared. That can't be. There's no planet on radar. It is not Motavia. It is not Namek. It... Of course it is not Parma, because that blew the fuck up. There's no such planet in my database. This must be Rick Ross! The entire planet was a rapper all along. Welcome to Rick Ross! Welcome, protectors. Welcome. What was that? You ask that question, like, all the time. Literally, something happens and you shout, what was that? I'm just trying to understand what's going on. Someone farts, you say, what was that? A pin drops, you shout, what was that? I'm just being inquisitive, that's all. No, it's actually really annoying. I concur. Anyway, there's a voice. There's a voice in my head. I am Le Roof of Rick Ross. The roof, the roof, the roof is on fire. I remain in this land to pass on the secret of Genesis. Genesis, what's that? So, the whole planet was rapper Rick Ross the entire time. He's like Mongo, the living planet. Yes, it is I. I am Rick Ross, the fourth planet of Algo. What? Fourth planet? There's only supposed to be three planets in Algo. Otavia, Parma, which has been uh, 86th, and Namek. Rick Ross is a planet that has been protected by a powerful and invisible barrier. I am Dome. There's no such thing as new types. There are people with special powers, but they are not new types. That is dumb. No normal being is able to see or even sense it. I didn't know such a planet existed. Moreover, the planet's orbit is highly elliptical. It only gets close to Algo once every thousand years. So it's an orbit like that of a comet. The arrow prism shows the way when Rick Ross returns. So this is what they mean by return. This is not my first time playing it, but this is my first time getting this far. Uh, the last time I played this, I think the farthest I got was when we fought, uh, was fighting Zeo. So this is what they mean by return. And that's why it was hidden until now! The roof! I just wanted to say that. It's a funny name. We came all the way here because we wanted to find out what we could do about the prof Dark Force! What is Dark Force? And why is it a jerk? Exactly where is it now? We were told that you would tell us everything so that you're on the hook. That's a law. You have to tell us if we ask you. Now tell me! You courageous protectors who, uh, hold on a second, I, I just written down. 
<coughs> you courageous protectors who came all the way to Rick Ross, I have much to tell you. But first, you must perform a task. There are two towers in Rick Ross called the Courage Tower and the Strength Tower. There used to be a Wisdom Tower, at least in the planning stages, but we never finished it. And so it uh, it's more like the Wisdom Foundation. Nice place, though. Lovely garden. Go meet the guardians of those two towers. When you return, I will truly recognize you as the protectors. And we'll then tell you all you need to know. Protectors? Are you testing us? I'm not very good at tests. Yes, I am. And no, you aren't. Please understand, this is absolutely necessary. Please hurry. The hand of darkness stirs toward this planet. Beloved ones, I await your return. Well, that was a thing. Well, at least we're finally getting some fucking equipment. Well, that was a trip. music wind up oh no it's the same chumps that we fought everywhere we've gone and rune died damn that didn't take long at all damn shame he's so fucking spongy Thank you, Dory. I forgot she had a healing, a heal everyone ability. Dang it. That would have been immensely useful. Well, we're putting Rune at the head of the party because um, he is the leader. And Chaz at the back because uh, fuck Chaz. He sucks.
Hmm, none of that works. Everyone got a level boost. B -b -b boost. Ah, Moon Dew. I need that. I guess this is where I'll be farming for a bit. Sure wish I had Piccolo still. I wonder if I can go pick him up. So, uh, let's go back to the spaceship and see if we can go pick up Piccolo. I would like to have my uh, healer back. fucking done yet? Well, this was a waste of time. Okay, let's try this again. This time, let's not suck at it. Gotta believe. 
we can finish this game in this sitting. Anger Tower? Who oh, dare to enter the Anger Tower? Be gone! You're not cool enough to hang out at the Anger Tower! Okay. I gotta go to these towers. Did Chaz die? Uh, no. Chaz just moved over. Because, uh, it turns out Seth was actually Dark Force the whole time. That's why he kept complimenting Chaz and telling him how good he was, how cool he was. Anybody that thinks Chaz is cool has gotta be evil. Okay. So far, so good.
Green Cobra Commander here. Come on! Ugly fusion monster. Gross. The music here sucks. Yeah, the music has been pretty strong so far. But this is just not good. What the fuck? The, the anti-spirals? So you're the people sent here by LaRouf. Go ahead and try to beat me. Prove that you're qualified to be protectors. You can't push change to get help because you're just have to All right. Told to hydrate.
Oh, come on! This is getting re goddamn ridiculous. Man. It's about to be the Chaz and Ren show. That's fucking sucks. Soul do left. Nope. Is it? So I do my best with this. running out of the ability to heal tank this. Holy shit! This is it. Either we win or we lose. Holy shit! Hey, we got booty in the chat. Booty in the chat. I repeat, there is booty in the chat. Uh, the Riker Ring.
that was crazy. Okay. Now I gotta go hit that other tower. Okay, so there is, uh, that's one tower down. We just gotta knock down this other tower, and then I guess go do that third tower. Moon do, gotta do the do. Hopefully we don't suck on our way up. Man, Rune, come on, man. What is what is it about this place that you just cannot survive? When you were cool, man. Finally. Okay, let's see, Rika. Ha! It's driving me crazy. I just, I just want to be done with this game. So I can play Dragon Quest.
these guys are. Driving you crazy? Yeah, a little bit. At least I'm getting some Leo. At least I'm getting some levels. Save again. Let's fucking do it. They come and they come, but they're all sissies. I be getting all kinds of bored. If you've passed the roof scrutiny, try to take me if you can. We joked about it, the roof was on fire. You know, you're in for a hell of a time when the dungeon boss is already killing motherfuckers before you even fight it, right? What's going on here, big guy?
Nelly. these guys again Chaz and Ren should not be soloing the boss together I don't like them the idea of them being friends it's wrong it's wrong I say better than I thought. That's comforting. Go ahead, take these objects. They are proof that you, uh, that you need. Motor ring. Hollow ring. Uh, Namek ring. Okay, so... Whip. Oh! They all have rings now. They're they're the four light warriors. Can I have an explanation, please, sir? Please pull up the Wikipedia article. Ah, protectors, you have carried out your mission well. You have proven yourselves, and I can enlighten you with the secret of Algo's genesis. Many billions of years ago, a spiritual life form split into two lesser beings who eventually began to fight. After a long and terrible battle, there was finally a victor. The winner banished the enemy's spiritual life form to another dimension. We call the victorious side the Great Light, and the defeated one the Profound Darkness. We weren't very imaginative at the time, but uh, once the names were made, we were kind of stuck. Light and Darkness! I wonder if there's a connection. The Great Light feared the resurrection of the Profound Darkness and placed a seal over the dimensional portal. A seal. 
You mean like the kind of seals that people use to keep things from opening? Yes, Snake. Just like that. That's right. A gigantic seal of three planets on one fixed star. No. Can't be. Yes. The Elgo Star System. The Great Light also distributed protectors of the seal between the three tribes. The Parmanians, the Rotavians, and the Namekians. But there were fluctuations in the strength of the seal. Once every thousand years, its power would weaken drastically. As a warning of this phenomenon, the Great Light created Rick Ross. Which returns to Algo once every thousand years, and we still lay a roof. But what use is an invisible planet as a warning? The Great Light knew that through the generations, the Protectors would forget their mission. They kind of suck like that. So Rick Ross was designed to break its silence when the seal's final moment came. To remind the protectors, uh, you got shit to do. The seal's final moment? What do you mean by final moment? Throughout time, the profound darkness has seethed with animosity and the need for revenge. Once every thousand years, when the strength of the seal weakens, the most intense part of the profound darkness, hate-filled spirit is able to break through the portal and come to Algo in physical form. So that's what Dark Force was. Every time a courageous person would defeat Dark Force and bring about a brief period of peace by, uh, curb stomping the fuck out of it. The profound darkness is patient, and finally, it destroyed the planet of Parma in battle. That means part of the seal is gone! Bingo! Now, a thousand years later, profound darkness is trying to break completely free at last! The seal's final moment! What do you mean? Like, are, are, are you serious? I literally just explained it. Like, all of it. Oh, we're fucked, aren't we, if you're our last hope? Why did it have to be this way? Well, it was a nice universe we had once. Are you saying this is happening? Sure. Maybe. The darkness will come, will once again wield its frightening power. And completely break the seal or or what someone will conquer the darkness and render the seal meaningless someone like us no god god no 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 oh no sweetheart no no uh you're basically placeholders you are there to keep the uh four uh rings uh warm until the four light warriors can show up Protectors, listen carefully. If the darkness escapes the seal, that's it. Game over. The only way to prevent this is to go to the darkness, enter its dimension, and destroy it. As long as you have those rings of the stars, you should be able to withstand the largest part of the power of the darkness. So the time has come. Obey the will of the great light and attack the profound darkness. Do what I say because I said it. It's the very mission that you as protectors have been born to. Who do you think we are? A bunch of guys that go around fighting evil people? Cause you'd be right. Uh, Chaz? I've been listening patiently and you keep talking about stuff that I don't understand. It's about time you started making sense. I'm not gonna do what you tell me to do. Anyway, what are we doing? The great light is no longer present in this galaxy. It has gone far away, beyond the rim. You're telling me he hands down missions and fucks off? I said a bad word. Give me a break. Missions, protectors, I don't care about any of that. It has nothing to do with us. I think I need a minute. This was profoundly stupid. Like... Chaz, you've, you've literally been fighting Dark Force, like, this entire time. Everything bad that's happened over the last... Since the game started, including Alice's death, is the result of Dark Force. And 
and now you're like, I'll fight Dark Force, but if you're gonna tell me to fight Dark Force, then I don't want to do it. Like, are, are you fucking for real right now? The, the fate of the universe is literally at stake. That has nothing to do with me. See, this is why Chaz cannot be the leader of the party. He's an idiot. Like, the time to have a discussion like this would have been, like, the first time you fought Dark Force. Like, everyone's looking at him like, are, are you fucking for real right now? Rika, Ren, Rune, like, what? You can't be serious. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, people of the chat, fans, newcomers, regulars, lend me your ears for a moment of discussion. It is a very rare thing where our protagonist is so stupid, so incompetent, that all of his friends, his companions, his traveling comp partners, the people that fight you know, side by side, live by the blade, together with them, look at their friend and go, are you fucking for real right now? It is so bizarre. <laughs> yes, vote in that poll. That poll is very important. <laughs> what was Chaz's endgame? I mean, Chaz started fighting Dark Force because... Zeo killed Alice, his mentor, that Rune was, you know, uh, totally hitting. Because Rune is a fucking baller. Uh, he found out that the entire solar system is now at risk, is in danger. That uh, Dark Force is going to pop out and he's going to blow up all of the planets. Because that's what Dark Force wants. So far, he has been the only... Uh, Chaz and his crew have been the only thing that have stood a chance against Dark Force compared to everyone else. And he has been very gung-ho about fighting Dark Force. He arrived on Rick Ross gung-ho about getting shit done. And now they're being told, here's what you need to do to fix everything. He's like, yeah, I don't want to do that. That sounds like work. That's not very fun. Oh my god, I'm... I apologize. I just... I needed... Wowzers. That's, uh... That was something. Okay. Save. Whew. I'm gonna go my own way. Did he just fucking quit? <laughs> Did he just fucking quit at the finish line? Are you fucking serious? 
Oh my god! Chaz has left the game. <laughs> We're not friends. Rune is a jerk. And Rika, I don't think she liked me to begin with, so I'm breaking up with her. We were never together. Well, I'm breaking up with you. And Ren, you have been very nice to me this entire time, and I, I thank you for that, but I have to go. My cat needs me. Chaz, no, don't go. Yeah, there's no one single truth, Chaz. Chaz Ashley. You fucking dick. You have set foot on Rick Ross. You must hurry. Whatever path you choose. Chaz, um, so what now? Rude. Fuck do you want, Chaz? <laughs> to tell you the truth, I don't know what's going on. to me. I'm suddenly reminded of Galaxy Quest. Explain it to him! I, I, I'm an actor on a show. No! Like you would a small child! We, we, we played pretend. Enrique tried to lift my spirits. Someone please kill this man. I don't want to live in a world where this guy is the main protagonist. Ah, uh, has son, I love you, but you are one dumb son of a bitch. Also, I lied. I don't love you at all. I just tolerate you. God damn! Chocolate Disco, you savage as fuck! Rika tried lifting my spirits by making me think she liked me. Now I know that was a lie. She was using me to make Ren jealous. Yeah, I was pretty open about that, like, the whole time. Why would I be jealous of you? I'm... I'm cool. I'm popular. People like me. But in truth, I... <sighs> Why did Alice have to go away? When is she coming back? Alice is in heaven, sweetheart. But she's coming back, right? Oh my god. The fate of the universe rests on this man's shoulders. And thank god. Thank all that is good in the universe. That Rune has some seriously powerful shoulders. 
so he can carry this fucking team. Oh my god. I actually thank Ren, whose fucking titanium shoulders and that fucking instant full heal technique he has has carried this team for the last hour. I could only see that the person who taught me everything had died. And I really didn't understand that. I would have sacrificed anything, even my life, for the peaceful repose. There's no way that Chaz knows a word like repose. That's fuck. You're lying to me, game. What did he really say? I would do anything for the peaceful days of Alice's soul to come back. But gradually I found out that the people who depend on me to fight. That was half a sentence. Uh, so, well, folks, we're all screwed. Don't forget to turn the lights off on the way out, the way to the afterlife. Shut her down. The dream is over. That's all fine, isn't it, Jazz? But... I can't have the fate of all of Algo rest on my shoulders. Oh, oh, that's good because they actually rest on my shoulders. And I'm very tired from carrying you. Moreover, this fighting is a mission handed down from the Great Light. We have to dance to its tune. We're no different than Zeo, except he was king of the ring. I'm not from Texas. Bleh. I can't blame you for trying to use that fucking absurdly large melon on top of your shoulders to try and figure this out, but you need to shut the fuck up and uh, get over this because you're being a fucking moron. Chaz, there's someone I want you to meet. It, it, it better not be Santa Claus because Santa's not real. Wait a minute, Santa's not real? Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. So, Santa's real, he lives in our hearts. That's just what parents want you to think. No, it's somebody real. Somebody that can give you everything you need to get through this. The Lord Jesus Christ. Let's go, to, let's go to the expert mansion and we'll channel Jesus. We will summon Jesus. Let's go to Namek and wish on the Dragon Balls to get Jesus to show up. I hope whoever uh, Rune actually wants uh, Chaz to meet that it's really funny. Like I, I want it to be so fucking funny. Whoever he meets, I, I don't care who it what it is. It's, I just want it to be fucking funny because you're literally convincing somebody who's been gung ho about fighting evil and fighting bad guys and monsters. You're trying to convince him to save the universe by just doing what he was already doing. This is fucking ludicrous. Like... I don't know what they were thinking when they wrote this.
troops were involved. They wanted to write a 2012 plus shonen protagonist into an RPG. This guy, these guys were ahead of their time. Do I go to the Lutz cave? To the Lutz mobile. Da 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 Rune man. What? Chaz, the sacred sword, El Sidian, awaits you. The sacred sword, El Sidian. The sacred sword, El Sidian. The sacred sword, Elsa. It's El Sidian. El Sildian. El Sildian, say it! God damn it! That's a lot of syllables. That's really hard. It's probably the one and only weapon that has the power to destroy the profound darkness. I have no idea why we never used it up until now, but uh, here we are. So, Chaz, alone, go and meet with El Si- Damn it, now you've got me doing it! Meet Elsa. I really like the Frozen movie. I fucking hate you with every fiber of my being. In fact, when this adventure is done, assuming we survive, I'm going to recode the fucking Lutz orb so the next fucking guy that gets Lutz's memories gets my hatred of you! I bet you feel a lot better now that you got that off your chest. You should find the answer you're looking for. S-Sword Cave. What's in the cave, Rune? Only what you take with you. So my sword! There's swords in the cave! better save. Wow. Are you Elsa, the Great Sword? I really liked your movie, Frozen. I thought your songs were really cool. Alice liked that movie too. She used to play it for me. <laughs> she used to joke it was the only way to shut me up. And it was cheaper than a babysitter. So this is the Sacred Sword. Elsa. I really don't get it. Wait a minute. I hear a voice from somewhere. Pick up the sword, idiot! Pick up the sword! It's like it's far away. What's it trying to tell me? Pick it up, you idiot! Ah, you made it. Chaz Ashley. This is the place where the spirits of those who fought to protect Algo return to. This, this place is the Matrix! We're all or one! That means that Elsa the Sword is the, the Matrix of Leadership! If I take the Elsa Sword, that makes me the leader! No, it doesn't! Shut up! Chaz, you must take the El Sildi... Elsidian sword in your hand. 
I will grasp the Elsa sword. I have the power! He-Man! I am Chaz, Prince of Motavia, and this is my faithful companion, Rune. Shut up, don't talk to me. Fabulous secret powers were revealed to me when I went to Namek and pulled forth the Elsa sword and shouted, By the power of Grayskull, I have the power! And I became He Chaz! The most powerful Chaz in the universe! There's only one though, so I was already the best. And Rune became Battle Cat! Wait, what the fuck are you doing? Stop! Meow! Ha! Uh, I turned him into a tiger, and he meows. So that's the crew from. Isn't that the crew from Fantasy Star 2? Yeah, that's, that's the characters from Fantasy Star 2! Uh, I guess that would be the, from Fantasy Star 3. And, um... There's Alice. Ah, so you are Chaz, the victim that Rune selected. Do you understand? Um, is that a trick question? <laughs> Chaz, I entrust to you the care of the Elsildian. All of our thoughts are stored within that sword. We will always be with you, Chaz. Always. So, don't worry, leave it to me. I am all the protagonists now. Oh no, he's alive. I knew it. I can't have anything nice that I want. Uh, El Elsidian promised that it would give you power if you plucked it. There was no mistake in that. So, how do you feel? Rune! Ah, he's still dumb. Jazz! Quit crying like a bitch and let's save Algo already. I have, I, I don't want to hang out with you any more than I have to. I'm going to be honest with you. Doing it for all life in Algo and to create a future that is truly free of terror. Uh, God, what's, what, what's the phrase from Attack on Titan? Was it Shinzo wo Sasageo? Now give your heart up for uh, the future. A future unbound at last from the evil of the past. For that, I will. F but are you are you fucking for real right now? Okay, uh, kids, we need to stop and we need to talk about this again. So let's review. Chaz went to Rick Ross, and Rick Ross told him that literally the entire universe is on the verge of destruction if Dark Force breaks out of his dimensional seal. If, if he breaks out of the dead zone, everything dies. Chaz, who's been super gung-ho about fighting things up to this point, and fighting Dark Force, explains that this very simple explanation that a uh, bad man in bad place that's locked lock broke bad man come out kill everyone is too hard of a concept to understand 
and that he's not gonna fight Dark Force. And so he went and he plucked a magical sword and a magical sword just said, hey, if you don't do this, everyone dies. Well, why didn't you just say that from the beginning? I, I could fight for that because I'm a part of everyone. Are, Rick Ross really literally told you all life will be exterminated if Dark Force gets out of the, the dead zone. That doesn't sound like my problem. I... Uh, uh, I think I need to lay down. This... Holy shit. I've seen some dumbass protagonists but they always pull it together in the end. I mean, come, Naruto is a fucking moron. And then they, Naruto went up against God and actually came up with, you know, I've noticed that, you know, the more powerful these people are, the more they're affected by sexy, you know, the sexy jitsu for some reason. I'm gonna fucking do it. And it worked. And he was right. He was an idiot. And only an idiot would come up with, uh, let's show a bunch of fucking Bashonen naked dudes to God to distract her. Uh, this guy is just fucking dumb. Like, to be honest, it's like, what does he fucking believe in? I want to fight Dark Force because he's strong and he's a jerk and I, I hate his face. Yeah, uh, you guys get to go fight Dark Force again, but this time, uh, you're gonna beat him forever, because if he, you don't, he's gonna kill everyone. That doesn't sound like my problem. But then Elsa sang me a song, and gave me a cool sword to play with, and uh, there was ice cream, and there was Olaf, and now I have, I have powers, and I'm strong now, and for that I will fight. <laughs> this is this is literally a person that Kira doesn't but Kira Yamato doesn't believe in any of the things that he preaches Chaz's problem is that he can't believe in anything because he's too stupid to understand the concept of belief in a principle he's just gonna tell you I really don't get it I'm gonna crack open a cold one I need this. Oh boy. Thank God we're almost at the end.
But let's be real, chat. Am I wrong here? Am I wrong? Like, he, he physically can't believe in anything. He doesn't have the capacity for it. Chaz? Let's conquer! For all go! Go, Chaz, go. Okay. We have an emergency! Demi informs me that a disaster has erupted on Motavia. Chaz! All right. Let's hurry to Motavia! I am the leader! Oh, you're actually having to get your hands on that. Trust the Reverend Fifth One to be able to pick the one with ability. Hey, Piccolo came back. Oh, you made it, Chaz. Piccolo, are you okay now? Oh, Kira's here too. Hey. A minor sickness like that couldn't keep me in bed. Take me with you! There's reassurance in numbers. Since I'm so reliable, I'll accompany you! Piccolo and Kira, thank you. It's Han! And Grizz the Wookiee! And Demi! Hey, Chaz. You seem to have become stronger since we last met. I was scolded by Pana and I came anyway! Woo! The system is finally stabilized! Now I can go live my life, I guess, or fucking die! I have no purpose now! Everybody. Everybody. Yeah. Thank you so much. No, no, none of that. None of that. Demi, what is the disaster you reported? Well, a large hole suddenly opened north of Piatta. Am I saying that right? Piatta? The life forms around the hole are dying one after another. It's pretty crazy. Also, there's no gas or radiation emissions coming from the hole, so no idea what's happening. Yeah, there's uh, no need to verify it. Uh, it's, it's, it's Dark Force. We knew as soon as we arrived in Matavia. It's all due to the black energy wave, and a pretty strong one at that. It's the profound darkness. He finally opened the door from the dead zone. Chaz, let's go. Isn't this the last battle? Uh, really? You, you guys need taken care of? I'll be your big sister and look after you. Well, seeing that we're all here, I'd like all of you to go, but... There are only five rings of stars to protect us uh, from the power of darkness. So that means we have to choose one person to take. Ah, Tori Matavia has been my dream! I want to go and see all the famous places! Better hurry and clean everything up. How about it? If you take me, you won't have a moment of boredom. <laughs> Chaz, are you going to take Piccolo? Yeah, he's pretty funny. I like the cut of his jib. 
Just as I thought. You're a pretty good judge of character. You'll go far. So, um, why can't I equip the, uh, the ring? Well, it's a good thing we got Piccolo here, because ever since, you know... At some point, Rune started becoming a liability. Like, he's like, still great at attack, but... This isn't a painful ass maze. So we're, we're trapped here in the dead zone and it fucking sucks here. That'd be great if uh, the Wookiee was here. No wonder Garlic Jr. hates this place. This place fucking sucks. I don't want to be here anymore. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? just happened I'm I'm so confused
Piccolo eating shit again. Oh, that fucking blue ass! Cool. There's a death effect on the sword. Don't like it here. We're gonna finish it! <laughs> this edibles ain't shit. Last famous words of Chaz. Uh, speaking of edibles, um, have any of you guys seen that TikTok of that dude that ate that edible and he's crying in the car? That black guy, he's like, Why people, why you gotta make your edibles so strong? What are you running from? <laughs> he's just I don't know why is that was so funny. <laughs> Jesus, I have to go all the way back to the beginning of the fucking stage.
Okay, I'm confused. Are you fucking for real right now? So let's go, okay, let's go heal our guys. And then we're gonna get a fucking map of the dead zone. This is horse shit. This is the end. Hi, Cuban Anubis, how you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Okay. So we're going to save there. We're going to save there. Then I'm going to go get... Hey, I'm just walking here. Yeah, forget about it. I'm going to go get a map of the fucking dead zone. to turn the path to the final boss into a maze. Um, I don't know. What, what are your guys' opinions? Would you... Would you rather have the, the path to the final boss be a gauntlet or just a maze? the map of the dead zone now come to find out that I was actually going the right way the first time I just took a wrong turn and if I took the right turn it would have been a straight shot to the boss because of fucking course it is this is it though this is it Wolverines! Wolverines! This way. And up. Okay. This is, we're now officially a straight shot to the boss. There's no branching paths anymore. This is it. We're fucking going in! I can't believe I needed to get a map of the dead zone. This is fucking stupid.
Oh yeah. yeah epilep epilepsy warning. Cuban Anubis stubbed their toe. Oh no. How could this have happened? How could this easily preventable event have happened? Tofu. Alright. Uh, I think we have, uh, this is it. Oh. We're here! It's all ogre now. What's the max level? No idea. Is this the shape? The profound darkness is taken. Ah! What's happening? It's an emanation of the profound darkness. Anger. Hatred. Of all that lives. A great need to destroy. We've got to defeat this thing! This being must not be allowed to come to Algo. The portal's not completely open! We gotta take advantage of this opportunity! Chaz! Right! Let's go, everybody! Roger. Yes. This is it. Now we determine Algo's future. Our future. Which I still don't get. Okay.
We're gonna do it! What? Oh, second phase! This is it! Reinforce that barrier, baby. Who good call? for Sephiroth? Oh no! Uh, reinforce that barrier. Again. Shit, and that's with the, that, that fucking double strength barrier. Intense!
Motherfucker's trying to neutralize my barriers. I guess we could say that Final Star 4 is the earliest example of JRPG where the final boss suddenly grows tits. Probably the only example as far as anyone knows. Yeah! How do you go from amorphous blob to a demon titty monster? The world may never know. Well, that didn't work. Okay, let's try this again. It wasn't a one shot, I just, I chose my, uh, I, I chose poorly.
Ah! Here we go! We're gonna do it! Come on! We're gonna do it! We're gonna defeat the evil guy! That 
wasn't fair at all. Cover. This is getting ridiculous. Way to go, Ren. All right. Take three. This time with feeling you <laughs> <laughs> uh, if only I believed in myself, this would be so much easier. I've got the power of God and anime on my side.
Come on! This is insane! Jesus. Ugh. If you have the power of it. Ah, okay, we're doing it. Come on. I don't remember what these do. Come on, Chaz! Score some fucking goals! About to lose my healer. Sure would be nice if, uh, there was any indication that I was fucking doing shit. Just a few explosions in the face, you'll be fine.
Come on! Why must we cut these things so damn close? And why does Rune always eat shit? What's going on? The forest holding the dead, the, the dead space all open is gone. I sense a time warp. It's getting bigger. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. What are we supposed to do? I guess we sit out and wait to die then. What the? The Elsa! It's protecting us. It's beautiful. Thank you all. Let it go, let it go. Get us out of the dead zone now. <coughs> and then the sun came up. And Piccolo was happy. For once in his life. It's over, huh? Damn, Chaz. Yeah, it's over. I still don't get it, though. We were able to keep Olgo safe. And we have our very own spaceship! Departure preparations are complete. Well, I guess I'll head back to Namek, then. Gotta exterminate them blueskins. Taking all our jobs. We'll get a ride with Ren. Ah, it was a fun journey, Chaz. The likes of which I... The likes of which I... Haven't had in a long time. You should come visit Namek every once in a while. That's not possible. They don't got a spaceship. Because we stealing that ship, baby. Woo! And flapping their arms won't get them too far. <laughs> so I guess it's really goodbye, Chaz. Goodbye, headaches. Good. What a pity you won't be able to enjoy my wit anymore. Piccolo, I got a feeling we're going to see each other real soon. I will go to Zelen to assist my master, Ren. Goodbye, Chaz. Eventually the time will come when both my master and I will... ...become unnecessary to Algo, and we'll simply turn off this fee cease to function. But until that time, I will work to complete my duties. After I take everyone to Namek, I will return to Zelen. My work continues. I guess you'll need a support of the system a little while longer. You know, these planets die if that system stops working, like, ever. There will never be a time when we don't need that system. Ren, where's Rika? She has already gone to the Landale. What, did you think she was going to stay with you? She and I are totally a thing. Did, did you not realize that? I, we've been pretty obvious, and we've been broadcasting it really hard. I see. See you later, Chaz. Try not to die. I know it'll be hard. Maybe we'll meet again. Maybe. 
Spoiler alert, they did not meet again. Rika, we are leaving. Rune, don't you, like, gotta go back? I can get there my own way. Because I'm cool like that. Ren, I... Rika, the road you choose will probably be painful and, uh... Difficult. I hate that I can't control the boxes right now. You are our hope. You must be strong and live with pride. Wizard portal! Yes, Rin. Thank you. I gotta get back to Tonaway, Chaz. Thanks for everything. It was a hell of a good time. Woo! P is for perfection. E is for extension of all you puny races. R is for the revolution that has been televised. F is for how fucked you are, now allow me to reprise. Shoots chairs. Oh, sorry, that was, uh, Rune. That's my bad. After all this, I've become disgusted with some of the people there. <laughs> Fuck academ academia! I'll just leave to transform those feelings into, uh... inner strength. Goodbye, Chaz. The means will always have the means. It was an honor to serve with you, Chaz. Did you really just say that to Chaz? Well, Chaz, uh, I'll smell you later. I'm gonna wizard portal my way back to Namek, because I can literally go anywhere I want anytime I want, because I'm cool like that. Even though the battle against the ultimate fiend is over, My mission as Lutz must continue. You see, I must watch over all I'll go. That's how I have the ability to go anywhere I want, anytime I want, because I'm a fucking baller. I'm still lacking in training and experiences. I'm gonna bang abroad on every single planet. I must continue to improve myself and eventually pass my genes on to the next generation. My mimetic legacy. Oh yeah, and at some point I need to tell the next loot uh, not to be a fuck up. Won't we meet again? Probably not. Don't. <laughs> you little bitch, you gonna cry? You can live now without anyone else's help because all of the bad guys are dead. We killed them for you. But Rune, there's gotta be somebody still needs some killing. Rika, Chaz! Rika! Why would you jump? Rika, Chaz! So long, Chaz. Try not to swallow your own tongue. Uh, Rune! Rune, thank you, and goodbye, you fucking prick. Oh, what's that? Chaz finally grew himself a set of teeth! Ha <laughs> That's still baby teeth, but at least they're coming in! The long battle is over. We were able to free ourselves from the terrible curse of yore. To the souls of those who sacrificed their lives for Algo. Sleep in peace. 
So I killed them blue skins, man. I just want, I just want that village just grease every blue skin I found. From person to person. Everyone was so fucking done. They're just like, I'm leaving from age to age. As long as memories last. We will not forget the sacrifices that have been made. So you know what's really funny is that Chaz went and saved the universe and all the people that were there with him that could back up his claim that he did so fucked off. The eons old struggle between light and dark has ended, and now the curtain rises on a new age. That's the big takeaway. Everyone that could back up Chaz's story that he actually saved the universe fucked off to another planet. Because Grizz wasn't there. Han wasn't there. He did something. You know, Rika is there, but, you know, uh, is she really going to back him up? That's the funny thing, you know? It's like, Chaz did all that work, but he went home and he was still Chaz at the end, and everyone fucking hated him because he's an idiot. No, but I, I saved the universe one time. Oh, yeah? Prove it, smart guy. I can't. All the people that were there with me left. Well, Rika was there. She'll tell you. Oh, yeah, he saved the whole universe by himself. He's a good boy. Oh, I see. Ah, you, you saved the universe, didn't you, champ there, slugger? Well, you have fun playing and don't get in the way of the adults. You know, they're doing... They're doing the big person work. Uh, I can't believe we did it. That went a little bit longer than I thought it would because that, that boss was really fucking hard. Hey! Woo! Ah! Uh, so, the next RPG we're playing is going to be uh, Dragon Warrior, a.k.a. Dragon Quest. Um, because a friend of mine really wants to watch me play that. So we're going to do that next week. And I guess i got to play Xeonic Front because Micah spent the coins. So we're going to play Xeonic Front next week instead of... Uh, uh, instead of Blue Stinger. We'll figure something out. Anyway, I want to thank everybody for coming out and hanging with me and watching. Uh, and thank you for playing. He would still have the magic sword uh, handle as proof. Would he, though? I got a feeling Rune took that shit with him. Like, okay, you're done. Give, give, give me the Elzidian. The Elzidian back. My Elsa sword. Uh, Zionic Front, is that a Gundam game? Yes. I've actually played it before. Uh, the archive of that is on our YouTube channel. Uh, wow, that was intense. No, oh, they don't make them like that anymore. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but it was, it was fun, and I'm glad we got to share this experience together because Chaz is a fucking moron, and now everyone knows. He's like the naif dude of idiots, you know. Uh, Chaz is an idiot, and now everyone knows. Okay. Who can we raid? I know who we can raid. The 
Let's go raid Sai, because she's on right now. What the hell is she doing? Well, we're going to go find out. I want to thank everyone for coming out and hanging out with us. Uh, Bully Night is uh, Friday, as always. Uh, if you're interested, make sure you uh, sign up for the Tournament of Bullies, because that is coming up. Um, Monday, we're gonna do Castle. We're gonna finally do Castlevania, because my buddy has finally recovered from the stomach flu. That's why he we couldn't do it Monday. We did Mario instead. And then next week, we're gonna do Dragon Quest and Xeonic uh, Front. All right. Let's go say hi to Sai.